This is the New Balance MX519 shoe. Yes, this is an athletic trainer shoe. Take a look at that sole. This shoe has sole. <laughs> Sorry, couldn't help it. So this is, um, yeah, the New Balance. This is a very lightweight shoe. I really like this. Uh, it's got the uh, New Balance logo raised and stitched on the outside, but very nice and um, doesn't stand out. So if you're using this for like an, you know, a, uh, understated shoe that you want to wear like uh, some dress clothing with but you want your feet to be comfortable this would be a good one uh, also if you need this for food service a lot of waiters uh, you know wear these kind of kinds of shoes on the inside though the new balance N is not raised like it is on the outside so that would have been cool on the outside to make it a little less conspicuous but it also has the New Balance logo on the back, and it has it actually on the tread, so that's kind of interesting. Um, I don't think I've seen that before. This big pocket back here is good. Got a couple channels here. This is not non-slip, so if you're doing work in wet areas, this is not rated non-slip, but it's a very comfortable shoe, very lightweight. I always like the insoles here. They're always good. And you can actually take them out and replace them, but they're glued in. So um, you're probably going to want to keep these in here, but it's okay because they're very comfortable. There's a lot of room in the toe box. This is the wide version, but you can get this in the D width. This is the E width. Um, strong grommets. I've never had any of these laces break on me. Uh, there, it does say 519 on the tongue. You can see that right there. If that's important to you, it also has the manufacturer date. And these just happen to be from Amazon. It looks like the manufacturer date on these is 2020. So they've been sitting around for a while. But that's okay. Very flexible. Um, right here, looks like if you drop so drip something on here, you wouldn't have any problem. Like if you're just, like, say you're uh, pouring liquids and they hit two right here on the shoe, it's not going to be a problem getting wet. However, there are vents here on the side of the shoe in the front. So if you step into a puddle, you're gonna get some water in here. So you're probably good up until about this deep. So as long as you're talking about wet floors, you're probably good. If you're talking about like running around a gutter that's filled with water, you're talking about getting your feet wet. But uh, overall, very nice looking shoe, I think. Padded collars. There is no grab here. There's no loop. Some of the uh, shoes have, the New Balance athletic shoes have loops here where you can grab or you can pull or you can hang your shoes to dry. Uh, that is not the case here. Again, the oh, ultra soft padding in there. It says ultra soft and it is ultra soft. Um, would I buy the shoe? Absolutely, 100%. Good deal. This is about $74 on Amazon. Uh, look for sales this does go on sale uh looks like a very solid stitching and um yeah overall great shoe so that's the uh mx519 hope you guys have a great day today thanks for supporting the channel 13,782 subscribers love you all and i'll talk to you in the comments see you on the next one